Hey everybody, it's Donna from Tarot Tarot doing another Sunday Smackdown. We're going to take this die, which has all 12 signs on it. We're going to roll it twice and find out who is dealing with who. So let's find out who is in a relationship with who. Um, Sagittarius. Who is Sag in a... And, oh, opposite track again. So Sagittarius and Gemini. We just did Taurus and um, Scorpio, but now we're doing Sag and Gemini. All right, so let's choose a spread. And we're going to take out all the money spreads and the career spreads and all that stuff. I feel like... Am I, okay. Am I having a wardrobe malfunction going on here? <laughs> Not the most flattering view. All right, so let's see. Take out the money and career spreads and all that happy stuff. Um, relationship problems. Okay. It is a six-card spread done with... 20 is Mabromig. Ugh. Do we want to... Let me just make sure. Yeah, I don't want to use Mabromic for that. I just don't. I, it's, it's a pain in the ass. It's a, it's a weird deck. 17 is dogs. Seriously? I'm not doing that one either. That's also a weird deck. I want something that's straightforward for you all. I want you to get a clear message. So we are going to use... 20 again. I'm not doing it. I'm not, we're not doing Mabromic, so don't even. 15 is illuminated. That's fine. We can use that. And I just knocked over this deck. Emperor on the bottom. So maybe you're dealing with somebody who's a little bit bossy. <laughs> All right. So this deck, this is illuminated tarot. We're going to use this to answer um, some questions. So you have, what is the problem? First of all, okay, there's communication. So if you're not talking, communication is coming in because when I shuffle, put these away, you get the, uh, the Ace of Swords on the bottom of the deck. So let's see. What is the problem? It says the problem, how you contributed, how they contributed, what can you do to fix it? What will make it worse? What is the ideal outcome? So let's see. What's the problem, first of all? Um, feeling like it's done, feeling stabbed in the back and betrayed. This is the problem. And actually, you know what, this is a, a different, this is a unique deck because this deck puts the major arcana in with the minor arcana. So the Ten of Swords is also, look for blue. I want to see what they say. This is really aggravating um, because it's not normal. Here it is. Okay, so Ten of, and the Judgment card. Okay, so that makes sense because he's announcing something. Look announcing something see how he's, he's making an announcement so making a decision um so the problem being feeling like it's done feeling stabbed in the back betrayed um possibly somebody i don't know if they gossiped or if they talked too much like that they shared too much um, with other people. I almost feel like, cause look, when I look at it, I see this person, like obviously it's a rooster, but I see this representing somebody like, um, you know, letting information out, saying too much, telling people, you know, not keeping things private. So, um, how you contributed six of cups. Did you deal with somebody from the past or were you stuck in the past? Did you let the past, um, interfere in some way? Where's my neighbor? Um, because cups, where's my cups? Um, six of hearts is also the lover's card. I knew there was something. To, so you've got major arcana for sure in this spread already. The judgment card and the, the lover's card. Um, but so did you, it's how you contributed. So did you deal with somebody from the past or let something from the past, a lover from the past, interfere, or um, something about a past relationship somehow in intruded, so you didn't want to let go of the past, maybe? Because hmm. this is showing this is how you contributed. This is the Six of Cups and the Lover's card in the Illuminated Terror. So how they contributed... Um, that's Knight of Wands. Ugh. 
player, player, player. So the Knight of Wands, the Jack of Clubs is like the Knight of Wands. Um, they might even be a little bit bipolar because when I look at this, I see up and down. I see up and down energy. And that could be like in and out, up, down, in and out. So um, you may have dealt with somebody who's kind of fickle and can't decide what they want. Um, what you can do to fix it. I don't know why it should be on you, but okay. Three of Cups, reunite. Reunite and share love. But there's notice there's three hands, like three different, representing three different people in the picture. Maybe. I don't know if you can get advice from somebody. It's not the Three of Pentacles, but, because um, Three of Pentacles a lot of times is an advice card, but Three of Cups is like reunite. Um, but, you know, sharing, sharing love, sharing what you have, sharing your emotions. Um, what will make it worse? Moving on. Moving on to calmer water. So um, it's kind of telling you to reunite with this person. And the ideal outcome, I, I know, could, they could be a hot mess. The ideal outcome is rushing in with communication. Um, and it's also... This is also another major arcana, and it is, which one is that? No, it's not. Okay. Um, I thought it was another major arcana, but basically the ideal outcome is rushing in with communication. But look at this. This doesn't say communication to me. This looks like building. <laughs> The ideal outcome to me when I look at this is um, building a nest together, building a home together, building a family. So on the bottom of the deck, king of hearts, that's like the, the king of emotion. And once again, when I look at it, it's like up and down, up and down. So is somebody's emotions up and down? Is that what's going on here? Well, they put in the, they work. They might be somebody who has a, like, makes, <laughs> oh, excuse me, <laughs> it's, it might be somebody who, um, who makes things, maybe their job is that they make things, I don't know, create, their, they create in some way, all right, so, I don't know if you're the Taurus or the Scorpio, but let's do six cards, Donna's Destiny, and then we'll end this smackdown, if this has any way, shape, or form, um, provide any kind of clarity, let me know. All right, so six cards. New look is in reverse. They lied about it. Is in reverse. Is in reverse. So they didn't lie about it. success and career. So if you thought somebody lied about something, they didn't. Um, but success and career. Pay it forward is sideways. Play more. You're too serious is upright. And take a chance. So at the bottom of the deck, oops, uh, buy a lottery ticket is in reverse. So don't do that. <laughs> don't gamble. All right. Thank you. Love you. And I'll see you in the next SmackDown.